like I really don't like the intro. <laughs> As you can tell, I'm obviously somewhere else. I'm on the floor. I don't have my vanity anymore. Um, and yeah, so for anybody who cares, I'm on the floor. I am coming closer to the due date, so I want to make this video. People also want me to make this video. I haven't gone around to it. Um, I also just recently made my bag um i was supposed to make it like two weeks ago i just barely did it and um yeah so we're gonna get into what's in my bag I'm a cringe. what for what okay I was rudely interrupted. Um, so, I'm gonna start with the outfit that I plan on taking him. Um, and then I'll get to my stuff. I want to take this. It's backwards. Um, it's a Pooh Bear little footsie one. Um, my mom told me to bring an extra one, which is this one. So this is a backup one, which is, um, the same size, zero to three, but it's a lot, a lot, um, shorter than the Pooh Bear. Um, I was told that my baby is very short. So I brought a long one and a short one for him. I also brought these little mittens for his hands, um, which the yellow ones will match with this one. So hopefully he can wear this one. Um, but again, I was told that he was a short baby. Um, I also didn't have a beanie that matched so I got this one for him um, again it doesn't match I'm still looking to buy some before we go so that he matches but um, none of the beanies that I have in the drawer match so he's gonna have to settle what I brought for myself I'm not gonna be looking and I'm not gonna be looking cute. I already know. What I brought was two outfits because my mom thinks that they might keep me two days. Um, I brought shorts because I just get hot very easily. These are my softball shorts. Um, they have spanks under them. So I brought those and then just in case I'm cold, I brought my black sweats which is nothing cute so basically my pajamas slash like my workout clothes um that I used for softball I also brought two shirts that happen to both be my softball shirts <laughs> these are my softball shirts again I only wore these shirts for softball other than that, I wear these to go to bed, um, so I brought these shirts. I just brought clothes that I didn't really care about. Uh, I'm not worried about looking super duper cute. Um, I don't know why girls are, but I don't care. So, yep, I brought <sighs> some ugly ass clothes for me, is what I brought. Um, I'm also not taking makeup. Um, I did think about it. People were telling me to bring my makeup. Um, I don't see why I need to be wearing makeup. So I'm not bringing it. And um, I'm perfectly okay with that. Because there are days that I don't even wear makeup. Um, today is probably the first day 
this week that I put on makeup. I also brought a sports bra in which I just just bought. I haven't taken the tags off. It's just a Calvin one. <sighs> There's no padding or nothing. Um, I don't even like to wear bras, but I did bring a sports bra. I only brought one because um, none of my other ones fit me right now. That's new. Um, and it's a large and all my other ones are smalls so yeah I brought underwear too as well I'm not gonna not gonna show you my underwear because that's weird that's pretty much it for the clothes again um, I just brought very plain and boring clothes for myself because um, you know I'm giving birth and I'm not trying to look all cute and fancy and whatnot. So I didn't bring any makeup, anything like that. My mom brought me these. These are cute, huh? Um, these are nursing pads. She brought me these home from her work. Um, I didn't quite know how many I was gonna need, so like I put the whole box in my bag and I got nursing pads to stay dry, so. I got those. I also brought my own pads because my mom told me that she doesn't like the hospital ones. Um, honestly, don't care, don't mind. But she went and bought me my own pads that are pillows. They're huge. I packed a lot because, again, I don't know how many I'm gonna need. Um, so my whole front zipper of my bag are pads. I also brought a toothbrush and some toothpaste because I don't like hospital toothbrushes and toothpaste. So I brought my own and I got deodorants. My mom doesn't believe that they're going to let me shower, but if I'm staying there two days, um, I'm gonna shower. So I brought these little things honestly don't know where I got these. They're also head and shoulders, which I honestly dislike head and shoulders, but it's little packets of shampoo and conditioner um, that I found under my sink. Because we didn't have many one travel ones, so just took them from the sink. And that's it. That's everything that is in my bag. I know a lot of people told me to bring a book and earphones and da 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 that's in this bag this is my purse that i carry around every day everywhere i go my earphones and my charger stays in this bag so um i'll also be carrying this to the hospital so i don't see the need to like pack an extra head headphones and all that because they always go with me everywhere so I didn't put those in my bag. I also don't read, so I'm not gonna take a book. I'm not gonna take a magazine. That's pretty much it. I, again, didn't pack this till last week. I was supposed to already have this packed by 37 weeks, and I'm already 38, 39 weeks. Um, I also didn't have a bag, so it is in my diaper bag. My mom said she was gonna buy me a new one, and she hasn't done that, so I just put it in my my own diaper bag. And yeah, that's all I have, that's it. Thank you for watching what's in my boring ass bag. My baby is due August 20th. Um, I'm already dilated out of one. Hopefully I can get him out sooner because I'm honestly just going through it. It's super hot in Vegas. I'm so tired of this. Um, I want him to be out already because I can't breathe. So yeah, that's the update. That's where we are. Um, and hopefully by the next video he will be out into this world. At Woo Arts did make my... Um, my intro so if you want to go and follow them on instagram their edits are super freaking cool i really love them and um go follow them thank you i don't know why i said thank you
I'm socially awkward, so. I love to get to